Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel and today's video. Today, I am super excited because I am going to do a makeup tutorial and I'm going to use the Hasina palette. I think you already have seen it on the thumbnail or in the description or in the um, title of this video or whatever, but I am super excited. I'm going to show you the palette. So if you're new to my channel, you don't know this, but I have been drooling over the Hasina palette for the longest time and I finally got it in the mail. This is from the brand Blush Tribe. I have featured them before on my channel because I actually bought this palette from them a couple of months ago. I will leave, I, like, I have so many tutorials with this. I have reviews, I have three looks, one palette. I have a video where I use this and another palette. Like, I have used this in so many tutorials. Uh, it's a rainbow palette, but it has more than like one green. It has two greens, two blues, two purples, and so on. And this is from a UK-based brand. It's an indie brand. And I love this palette. Blush Tribe is just killing it. They just launched or they just revealed their Hasina 2 palette. And I will leave it up here. Like, honestly, you will see me talk about this in my Willy Bite video or if I have already talked about it. Like, oh, I'm so excited with this brand. But the Hasina palette is stunning. Like, the packaging on this is beautiful. I love it. And then it comes with a little sheath. And then the most important thing, like here's the palette. This is obviously cruelty free and everything. And then it looks like this. Mm, it's stunning. The owner of Blush Tribe did not send this to me. Like I paid for this. I paid for that one as well. But she actually sent me this palette that I paid for, obviously, but she sent me this palette as well. This is the Malika palette, and I will leave a picture on it right here because the shadow actually arrived broken, so I am repressing it right now. I repressed it before I sat down to film this, so um, I will do videos with it and everything, so don't get me wrong. It's just that it's kind of laying and drying, so I can't really show it right now, but I will have a picture right here just so you can see how the Malika palette looks. And before you ask, I am going to do three looks with this palette, but I usually like to do like a first impression with you guys and then do a three looks one palette and then a review of this. So I will do that, of course. So I'm just going to zoom you guys in and then we can start. Okay, so now when you are up and close and personal, we are going to try this palette. I'm not sure what I want to do, and I forgot to mention this, but in the um, Blossom palette, this palette, this is a full matte palette, so this is the first time I'm going to try out their shimmers, and we're gonna see. Can you see that I haven't even swatched this palette? I really, really enjoy this shade right here. It's a really pretty pink shade. So I'm gonna start off with this shade, which is called Saina, 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 I think it's called. So I'm taking this on a Sigma E40 brush and we're just gonna start with this. It's blending out really beautifully. Dipping in a second time. And they don't contain, I don't know how well you can see, but they don't contain a lot of kick up. So that's nice. But anyway, let's see. I don't know when you are seeing this because I am pre-filming a lot, but um, today is the first day of my hubby's vacation and it's like so bad weather. But that was really nice for me because then I could sit down and film <laughs> because I really wanted to play with this palette. Like honestly, I think this looks so beautifully. The shadow doesn't blend away, it blends out really easy. It's a real pretty shade. Okay, so when it comes to the shimmers, I'm not really drawn to the yellow, no, <laughs> no, the gold, and this bronze shade. They're just not my shades. I really like the green, the blue, this blue, and then this one. So I can't really decide which one I want to use. Should we swatch them? Let's swatch them. Ooh, I'm so excited. I think she did it again. 
Oh, she did it again. Do you see these swatches? Like, honestly, they are finger swatches, obviously, but oh my god, they look cute. You know what? I'm gonna ask my hubby. He can decide. I'm gonna ask him, so wait. Okay, he voted for this blue shade, which is the shade Maha, which is this one. So this is the one we're gonna use. I think that this is stunning. Like, this is without any glitter glue. This is without me... Uh, spraying my brush with any setting spray or anything like this this is I think like I, I am going to review this palette I am but I'm sold I'm sold so now I'm going back into the shade Fatima and I'm just applying it over the blue and that doesn't really help. You know what? Um, I'm going to take the shade uh, Ar Arwa? Ar 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 Arwa. Ar Arwa. Arwa. I don't know. This pink shade uh, just on a small little packing brush. And I'm just going to pack this between the blue and the pink. That usually helps with the harsh lines. This isn't as dark as the um the pink shade but it, it it helps a bit anyway and then i'm going in a little bit more with our matte shade on top of this to blend everything out so i want to do something else on my bottom lash row so i think i'm gonna go in with some blue right here and then i think i'm gonna go in with some green right here do you think that's a mistake we're gonna we're gonna try it so the blue shade is called N nas nasia and it's this one and then the green one is called Yamilia ja Yamila and it's this one Ooh, okay the green shade contained a lot of kick up so be if you're if you are gonna use this palette like be a, a bit careful and now we're gonna in with the green shade like honestly oh so pretty i like also that the that the green and blue shade are fairly easy to like blend into each other it looks nice and i also want to take this shade right here the, the um arwa shade and i'm gonna use it as a inner corner highlight And I like to take my highlight like this and I kind of connect them like so. I am going to do the rest of my makeup off camera and then I will be right back. Okay, so I'm done. I took a little bit of the ColourPop teaspoon gel eyeliner in my waterline. I have the Scandal Lashes, False Lashes in the style Ultimatum. These are very flashy, very like party-esque like, but I feel like that was needed. And I took a bright pink lip because I haven't had that in a long time. This is um, Ofra Cosmetics Santa Monica, real pretty. And then I just put my hair to the side, my bang up, because my bang is like it's crazy it's crazy right now so yeah and my hoops first impression on the hasina palette like gorgeous gorgeous i think the mattes work to perfection like okay this one had a lot of kick up but otherwise like the mattes work to perfection i don't care i just have to say this i don't care about kick up um i think that as a first impression i can recommend it but I won't because I will do a full review on it. I will try each and every shade. So I will have a like full, full review up. I am trying to have a little bit of a, a vacation. So three looks with this will be coming, but I don't really know how quick it comes. It kind of depends on what me and my boyfriend are doing. So it might take a two two weeks two weeks or something, or it will take one week. You know, I don't really know, but I will try to be as quick as I can because I really want to use this palette. Um, this palette is, I think it is twenty three pounds or something. Uh, shipping kind of depends on where you live, but they do ship worldwide except for one or two countries. I don't really know. Um, truly recommend it. The owner is real nice or real fast at answering to comments and answering to emails and dms and yada 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 so yes i will leave blush tribes website in my description box in case you want to check it out 
uh, yeah, that was all for me today. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and that I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.